Hello there, this is Rahil from All About Affiliate Marketing. In today's video, we'll talk about how to create an affiliate account with ClickBank. Before we start, let's talk a bit about them. So ClickBank is one of the top affiliate marketing networks out there. They provide a platform to affiliate to connect with the brands or we may call them sellers. When affiliates promote the product and services or product or services of these brands and bring sales to them and return, affiliates get commission via the platform of ClickBank. So that's how they're involved. Through them, you can connect with many brands, product or services. Now, without further ado, let's go ahead and create an affiliate account with ClickBank. To do that, you can open any, any browser on your computer system. Uh, and just if you don't know the website, you can search for ClickBank using any search engine like Google search. And the very first website that you see, which is clickbank.com. So that's the website. You can go to their website by clicking on it. And this is their website you can see. If you want to read through, you can go ahead and understand more about them. But for now, we will create an affiliate account. To do that, click on the Start Here button that you see on top right hand side. Now it should open a pop up with some questions. So give it a few seconds. Here we are. All right, let's customize your ClickBank experience. Please select the primary reason. So here we have to select the primary reason that why we are signing up with them. Uh, so in my case, I'm gonna go with, I want to promote ClickBank product as affiliates. So when they say ClickBank product, they're referring to the sellers or, or brands product, right? Then the next one. Now from here, the forthcoming questions uh, would be related to your experience as an affiliate. So let's click on sounds good. Now, do you have experience promoting offers as an affiliate? So whatever options that, that you see, you have to select according to your experience and you have to be as accurate as you can because all these things will be reviewed by ClickBank later on. So it's always better to, to provide accurate information than to provide any information that comes to your mind. So yes, I have promoted known ClickBank offers before. Now, which best, uh, which best describes you? I'm making less than $50,000 in annual affiliate com uh, commissions and then read the other one as well. So I'm just gonna go with this one. What type of product do you want to promote? So I can choose from the, the primary kind of product, but that doesn't necessarily mean that I can only pr promote those products. It's just the primary product that I'm focusing on. So I'll go with personal development. Please select all that apply to you. Now you can read through and whatever applies to you, you can select. In my case, let's say I, I have this and I have 25K followers on social media and I see. So it's it's fine. You can do more than one selection in here. Again, whatever applies to you. It's basically showing your, your marketplace out there. What country are you located in? So you can select your country. If you don't see in the list, click on other. Uh, otherwise, just go with the country. Now, what is the biggest factor motivating you to explore affiliate marketing? So you can select from here, right? I'll go with turn patient into Korea. Do you currently have traffic or an audience to promote to? So choose the option accordingly, right? I'll go with this one. How do you plan on generating traffic? So you can select one from here. I'll just go with YouTube. Now, how did you hear about ClickBank? So you can write about like from where exactly you heard about ClickBank. In my case, I'm just gonna write YouTube videos. All right, last question. What email address would you like to use for this new account? Now again, only provide the email address that you have access to because you may get verification email later on. Click on submit. Now you're done with the with the, with the pop-up questions. Next you have to do is to click on watch the video. And wait for it to load. So it's basically about Spark, uh, educating on, on ClickBank, the courses they have. But you if you want, you can watch and you can buy the subscription. But if not, let's see. If I uh, check this, there should be an option somewhere down. Okay. 
let me click here on clickbank right so you have to play this video for for a few seconds for the option to appear here let's run it right all right as you can see uh i played it for a few seconds and these options just appeared so you can go down and here you see welcome to clickbank you can click on no thanks i choose to pass on this offer knowing that i'll see it again so again when you will be on this page this video will be here and there won't be any option just play for a few seconds and this option would appear you can click on this one no thanks i choose to pass on this offer and it should take you to the another page All right on here you'll see another video uh, you can you can pause it and click just click on no thanks just take me to my account again if you want to watch the video about spark campfire do watch it and add it to your card otherwise just click on no thanks just take me to my account All right so now you can wait All right we are here now in here you can select all the information you can type in these are like the basic information so in country you can select your country i'm just gonna go with mine which is india um in the first and last name you can enter your details and for for this video purpose i'm just using dummy information again for the educational purpose but i would not recommend you to do that any information that you fill in here ensure it's accurate right so the email address and the password so for password it's it's kind of very strict a requirement so ensure your your password is matching all these requirements i'll enter the password here and then you see currently this is not enabled for me to check mark for it to be enabled i have to click on continue to terms and conditions and wait for it to load once it's loaded, I can read all this and then I can go to the previous page and this option will be enabled with already check mark. So you can then click on join ClickBank. All right. This should take you to the next step. All right, so here we are. Now, if you want to join the free community, we can click on join free group. Otherwise, for now, I would just recommend click on no thanks and continue to sign up so that at least we can we can do sign up and have an account ourselves. All right. So in here, again, on this pop up, you can read through uh, what's done here. It's it's uh, attention click back sellers and affiliates. It's more like for for us to be aware of. We can download suppression list and then accept after reading it. Once done, whatever you see here right now, it's, it's a dashboard of ClickBank, but not everything is enabled because you have to add more information on the dashboard before things would appear here. So to do that, click on complete my profile. In here, I can read through whatever, whatever information I have filled in before. Uh, if I'm satisfied, just fill in the information that is not already here. So, for example, address. Again, my information here is dummy, except for the email address. But in your case, I would not recommend you to do that. Only enter the accurate information because your point would be to earn commission by promoting the product or services of the, uh, of the sellers from ClickBank. I'll just fill in the information, the dummy one. Now comes the zip code. Okay, after filling the address, how would you like to be paid? In here, I have to mention my name. Now, it is very important uh, when assume that if I'll get the payment via check from ClickBank, then the check will be issued on the name that's mentioned in here that I'm gonna mention in here. So whatever information you're mentioning, ensure you have uh, a bank account or any other account. Uh, basically with that name otherwise it will be tough to to cash out the payment in my case i'm going to use just a dummy name let's optimize your performance in here you can select the why why you're using clickbank so i want to promote product as an affiliate you can select 
and then you can select your company annual revenue so i'll just go with this and then click on save all right so you see the profile has been updated successfully and i see all these information in here all right i'll wait for it to load once again okay so here we are now next we have to do is we have to verify our email address to do that click on settings and then click on payment settings all right it's not here in that case we can go to profile and try to find that option if it's here no it's not here okay let's click on account all right so in accounts before we even update more information or verify our email address we have to we have to pick a nickname and this nickname is very important why because any tracking that will happen by clickbank this nickname will be used this nickname will be publicly available basically in your in your tracking links and this is what helps clickbank to track all the activities that comes from you so be careful of whatever nickname that you choose here other thing is remember it whatever whatever you have chose you might want to take a note of it and then just whenever you require it in the future you can use it the other thing to be aware of once you have picked a nickname you cannot edit it so it's just it will stay like that way all right so to create nickname you can click on create a nickname uh, select the account type so in our case i'm just going to go with affiliate promote products in nickname let me choose this so th these are the requirements for the nickname right so it will check if there is any existing nickname like this it will not accept otherwise it will just say congratulations the nickname is available right so once you have chose the nickname you can click on sign up right okay as you can see the nickname is created and it's here once it has been created again it's within account in here you have to click on this nickname it's an hyperlink so again when you click here it should take you to the next page and in here you can click on account settings all right so you must confirm your email address there's a hyperlink that says send, send a confirmation email to this email address or whatever you have provided so i just click on it and i should have received an email let me check my gmail account right i can refresh it it should sometimes take a few seconds for it to come right so it's here i can open the email and i can click on this link to verify my email address right so it will verify my email address and it will take me to the same page where i was and then again i can click on account settings so i have as you can see that that note was gone about email ver verification the next thing you have to do is to update your payment settings otherwise how will you receive the payment so on the same page within the account settings you can scroll down to payment information section and click on edit on that section in here and in here you can see two payment option which is check and direct deposit if you if by default it's check that's selected so they will any commission that gets generated and if it exceeds minimum hundred dollars it will be sent via check to this e address that you have provided issued on this name that you have given as a pay name you have an option to change the payment uh, payment method to direct deposit if you do that you can mention bank country bank city bank name and you know go with the banking information again whatever whatever you want to go with you can decide and do that so this is how you can update uh, the payment settings and once once you're fine with it again you can also ch uh, choose payment frequency and once you're fine with it you can click on save changes and it will be updated now all right so we have updated the the payment information and we have verified the email but what if you have some cushion and you you need more information on the platform of clickbank like you, you need a knowledge base where can you go and how can you find any related article that will help you to explore the dashboard of clickbank to do that 
again we are on this page you have to go to the to the to the main dashboard of clickbank so when you click on this icon it will take you here you can enter the email address and the password that you have selected you can also sign in using uh, using the okay let me write it again so you can sign in using the nickname it's up to you right so once you enter the detail here and click on sign in it should take you to the next page okay you can give it a few seconds so here we are this is the main dashboard so you can click on education and let's see where it takes us so this is spark uh, by clickbank you can explore more and learn but if you don't want to buy it it's all right you know you 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 can still go to support again on the from the main dashboard you can go to support and um, you can explore the knowledge base okay so as you can see these are all the articles whatever articles that that you want to read through you can read through and you can understand now if you click on clickbank uh, knowledge base then you will see all the articles whatever question you you may have you can explore these articles you can find your own answer and that's how you can learn more about clickbank but the question is what if you want to connect with someone you 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 have some question that's not answered by the knowledge base and you want to connect with the support team of clickbank so how would you do that so again from your main dashboard if you come down and you will see contact us hyperlink so you can click on it it should take you to this page where you will see that for affiliates there will be a chat widget available between this time on on this side this area of of the screen however if you do not see it and you still have an option to open a ticket uh, with them and how do you do that it's just by clicking on file a support ticket within support ticket section so if you click here you will see a form like this you can fill in the details your email address subject detail type of question account nickname any file that you want to attach and submit it so once you submit it the ticket will be submitted to the to the clickbank support team they will try to answer your, your question to the best of their ability and they're very good at answering that and this is how you will have your question answered so the next question is what if you sign out to do sign out you can click on your name and do sign out but what if you want to log in again how would you do that to log in let's say you can go to the website clickbank.com and to log in you can wait for the website to load and from here click on the login section right so in here again either you can use your email address or the nickname with password and click on login and this is how you will get into your publisher account you can you can get more products you can get services uh whatever they, they are offering you can promote those and start and whenever any sale would happen you will start generating commission so that's how you can you can use you can sign up with clickbank and you can promote them now if you want to know more about clickbank such as how to operate each section of clickbank like how to get the links how to promote any question related to clickbank that you want me to answer do mention it in the comment so that i would be able to i'll see if i can create more videos on it so that it will be helpful to you uh, in the meantime all the very best of to creating an account with clickbank and then to promote them further in the meantime do not forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and click on the bell icon so that any question that I try to answer for you, you get notified. Thank you for watching and have a great day.